Prices of goods and services have over the years been greatly impacted by major factors, including city depreciation and fuel price hikes. Consumers have always had to bear the brunt. Now that the local currency is making some gains and fuel prices witnessing some reduction, it is the hope of many that prices of goods and services will reflect the change. President of the Ghana Union of Traders Association, Dr. Joseph Obin, could not have said it any better. We believe that our members will also listen to our plea, um, to the fact that the consuming public need to be compensated, especially at this time when they are going for Christmas. So uh, we believe that our members will listen to us. Mbakola is one of the largest markets in the capital. We are here to assess the reality on the ground, whether prices have been adjusted in accordance with the positive trends regarding the city and fuel. Makola in Accra is a one-stop shop for anything consumables, clothing, you name it. No wonder complaint of high cost of doing business is greatly echoed here. But you'll be shocked to know that prices are still the same, knowing that the city is making some gains and fuel prices coming down. But for Azuma, who is into perishables like tomatoes and pineapples, she has no choice than to adjust prices slightly. I deal in perishables, so selling at higher prices will only incur losses. The faster they go, the better. For others, they will only run at a loss if they reduce prices to reflect current trend. For them, goods were bought when the city had depreciated largely against the United States dollar and it will be a loss for them to sell using the current exchange rate of the city to the U.S. dollar. The dollar, they go down do, but now the price, they can't deal with us. The amount of money I carry by the goods no, will not be the same as now. So I know if you reduce us as the dollar come down, I will reduce them. So now the, the price, the, if you so we go sell, how the price is there, as the dollar go up, no, so it will maintain for now. I have not gone back to for any goods. It's the old goods that I had. And it was, it's still at the old price. So if we reduce it now, you may end up not going to get, you get less than what you bought initially. So you can buy. Yeah, I have to say I have to say that the but still, prices now, you don't find the no one. You can find the no one. You can find the we know about the city gains, but our wares are still sold to us at the old price. So maybe in subsequent months, prices may change. Azuma claims greed has taken a larger part of traders' interest in their pricing. It is greed. We are our own enemies, causing our own harm. Government will have to do more to ensure a stable exchange rate if consumers are to feel the impact of recent gains by the Ghana city on the foreign exchange market. Traders that are dealing in perishables are the ones that are slightly adjusting their prices. But for the others, they are singing the same chorus. They expect their old consignments to get exhausted after when they get new consignments, that's when the new prices reflect accordingly. Josh Crane in TV3 News, Makala, Accra.